Now we are going to show how our automated remote telescope observatory's lab view program works. This is just a simulation and in this we haven't used a DAC that is connected to the motors of the telescope. We just show how the uh, azimuthal and anterior angle of the telescope gets aligned. I will run the program. Here you can see the area where the image of the eyepiece is depicted so the, whatever uh, is seen in the IPs is uh, shown in this box here we have controls camera setups and other settings in current position the azimuthal and altitude degrees of the telescope uh, at current at current time is shown here we have a go to option so that we can specify the degrees at which the telescope has to be aligned here we have the calibration to calibrate the telescope and we are here we have all the uh, other uh, controlling options first we will uh, see how to calibrate the calibration is done in uh, the in two ways by selecting some uh, a known object that is in the database or giving an value directly here i select polaris which is a which is commonly used for calibration so when i click the polaris you can see that the values are 0 0.6 that is 40 minutes and 11 degrees this is the location at which the polaris star light in the sky so there is a software called stellarium this virtually creates the appearance of the sky at a given point of time so now currently uh, in east we have Jupiter, Uranus and we can see in north we have the Polaris. The positions are 39 minutes and 11 degrees. So we have to manually align the telescope to the uh, pointing the uh, Polaris this is done by manual control and at this position the Polaris star appears let us assume so we now set the button and now the current position becomes the position of the Polaris so from now it is easy to move around with great precision Suppose I want to see Jupiter. So Jupiter is in 80 degree and 23 degree. These are the approximate values. 80 degree, 80 degree and 23 degree. And once I click the button go, the 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 position gets altered. You can see that an approximate position uh, is aligned to the telescope. Now using fine adjustments, we can easily point out Jupiter. Suppose if you if want to see some other planet like Uranus 
the it is 105 and 55 105 and 55 and then when I press go the telescope gets aligned to the that position and in Stellarium we, uh, we have a facility to interface with other software so by just uh, by, by just giving the name of the planet easily we can retrieve the uh, uh, position of the azimuthal and attitudes uh, uh, from lab view so it, it is uh, not it is not even necessary for the user to go uh, see uh, every time the current position by just clicking on the uh, whatever they need like if you want to see jupiter just click on jupiter and the uh, lab view program gets the information from the stellarium or also some of the website uh, constantly update the positions of the planets from this we can get the data and uh, easily move the telescope here we have the block diagram 